Okay, guys, so today we're going to learn about professions. Um, you're going to see that a lot of the professions are cognates. Some of them aren't. Some of them are even false cognates, but a good majority of them are true cognates. So the first word is le professioni. Repeat. Le professioni. That is the professions. Okay, and it's a cognate. The next one, un attore or un attrice. Repeat, un attore. That is an actor or an actress. Okay, different words for different genders. Un or una cantante. Repeat, un cantante. And this is kind of a cognate because if you think of the word to sing, it's cantare. So this is a singer. Now, whenever it says un or una, it means that could act as a girl or a boy, but it doesn't change the word. So if I want to say a female singer, I would say una cantante, male singer, un cantante. Un poliziote, polizioto, or una poliziota. Repeat, un poliziotto. That is a policeman or policewoman. Un artista, repeat, un artista. That's a cognate for artist. Un cuoco. Let's repeat. Un cuoco. Un cuoco is a chef. Again, male versus female. Un secretario or una secretaria. Again, for male and female. Repeat, un secretario. That is a secretary. Un pompere. Repeat, un pompere. That is a firefighter. Un giudice, repeat, un giudice, that is a judge. Un mecanico, repeat, un mecanico, a mechanic. Un postino or una postina. Let's repeat, un postino. That is a male man or male woman. Un dentista. Repeat, un dentista. That is exactly what it looks like, and it's a dentist. Some words in Italian do not change endings for girl or boy. So, for example, I would say un dentista for a male dentist. I know it doesn't sound um, right compared to other rules, but there's some words that we just don't change. Un dottore, una dottoressa. Let's repeat, un dottore. That is a doctor. Un 
un médico or una médica. Let's repeat, un médico. That is another way to say doctor, male and female. Un cameriere or una cameriera. Let's repeat, un cameriere. That is a waiter or waitress for um, male versus female. Un avocado or un avocatesa is a, not an avocado, a lawyer. Un pittore, repeat, un pittore. Un pittore is a painter. Un camionista, let's repeat, un camionista. That is a truck driver. Next one. Un autista de autobús. Let's repeat. Un autista de autobús is a bus driver. Un panetiere, let's repeat, un panetiere, that is a baker. Un parruquiere, let's repeat, un parruquiere, that's a hairdresser. Un falegiame, let's repeat, un falegiame, a carpenter. Un maestro, or una maestra, let's repeat, un maestro. A teacher. Un profesore, or una profesora, let's repeat, un profesore, is a teacher. Un costruttore, repeat, un costruttore. A construction worker. Uno scienzato. Repeat. Uno scienzato. A scientist. Un electricista, repeat, un electricista, an electrician.
un infermiere or un infermiera. Let's repeat, infermiere is a nurse. Uno scrittore or una scrittrice is a writer. Repeat, uno scrittore. Un musicista. Repeat, musicista. is a musician. Un uomo di affari or una donna di affari is a businessman or a woman. Un veterinario. Un veterinario is a veter veterinarian. Un giocatore di sport professionale is a professional sport player. So where it says sport, you would insert the type of sport. You can also say sport just in general as a sport player as well. Un soldato is a soldier. Un padre de casa or una madre de casa is a stay-at-home dad or mom. Una casalinga is a housewife. Un pensionato or una pensionata is someone who is retired, they get their pension. Un operaio is an employee. Lavorare is to work, it's a verb. Guardagnare is to earn money. L'ufficio is the office. Il lavoro is the job. Il lavoro. I soldi is the money.